Hey Cho Squad, welcome back to the channel. My name is Trophy. I make hair videos now. I'm starting to make hair videos more. I make mostly vlogs and mom content. So if you like any of that stuff, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, turn on your notification bell so you can be notified every single time I post a new video. But without further ado, we're about to get into today's video. I wanted to do a hair video today. Like I said, I'm gonna be doing more hair content. I'm gonna be playing on my hair a lot, y'all. So Y'all gonna be seeing a lot of natural hair videos again because, I mean, I ain't got no hair, so I got a plenty of time to play in it. We're gonna color it, we're gonna define it, we're gonna do all kinds of stuff to it. So, this is what my hair looks like right now. Um, I co-washed it this morning. So, this is what my natural hair looks like. It's a little damp. I think my curl pattern is like 4A, 4B. I don't think it's 4C. I remember when I first started making natural hair videos, I said my hair was 4C and I was attacked. So, <laughs> I don't think it's 4C, it's 4A, 4B, because I do have some curls, but it just it does take a lot of defining. Um, so yeah, that's what we're gonna do today. I'm gonna show you guys how, I, how I've been styling my TWA. I just uh, did the big chop again. If you guys haven't watched that video, I have the card up there on the screen. I just um, big chop my hair again, so I have to get used to styling it when it's short. I don't think my hair has ever been this short natural. When I did big chop it the first time, I think it was at least three inches, but I don't even think your girl got an inch right now. So, so since my hair is already done, I'm gonna add just a little bit more water, uh, just a little bit, but it's already pretty damp. Just spraying it with my spray bottle and working it into the hair. Now I'm about to add my leave-in conditioner. This is the leave-in conditioner that I'm using, the Camille Rose Curl Love Moisture Milk. I've been using this for years on my natural hair and it's just the go-to. So I'm gonna add about this much to my hair, not too much because I don't got too much hair. We're just gonna work that in. Matter of fact, I'm gonna add a little bit more. Now I'm gonna add some oil. This is the El Natural Light Hair and Body Oil. Pretty much the only oil I use. I always talk about this oil, y'all. I love it, I need to actually order some more. Just a little bit, and I'm gonna work that in the hair as well. The next product, which is what we're gonna use to define the curl, is you guys recommended to me. This is the Uncle Funky's Daughter Curly Magic Curl Stimulator. It has aloe vera, marshmallow, and nettle. <laughs> what? So this is what I'm gonna be uh, using to my hair to make my curls pop. So you guys see the before. And once we add this, it's gonna really help activate it. And I will be using my sponge as well. So not about this much, but I add a lot to like really saturate my curls, like a lot of it, because I want all of my curls to have some of the gel on it. So Want all the curls to be coated, all the curls have. See, y'all could already see that the curls are starting to come in, like especially if I rub it around. So it's like my ninth pump of the gel. Tenth eleven. <laughs> Spray a little bit more water. I like my hair to really be saturated. I find that when it's really saturated, it uh it helps the curls form better. I just want to make sure that I have the gel over everything. Ooh, over everything. So I think I got enough gel. I think that was like 12 pumps. So that's what it's looking like right now. 
Okay, now we're about to use this sponge. I need to get a new sponge. This is Terrell's old sponge. He gave it to me and I haven't gotten one of my own. So it looks a little grimy. It looks a little grimy. Y'all need me to see what this side looks like. But uh, I'm using this side right here with the little waves. And um, when I put it on my hair, I'm not gonna put too much pressure. Well, I'm not gonna put any pressure. I'm just going to just go in a circular direction, not adding pressure, and I'm gonna do my whole head, try to go in the same direction. Sometimes I'll be messing up, but try to go in the same direction and define all of these curls. So just showing you guys what it looks like from the sides and everything before, before I do that. So let's do it. Okay, so it's pretty much defined now, as you guys can see. Next, I'm gonna use my edge booster. This is what I'm using on my edges lately. My uh, baby hairs or edges, whatever you wanna call it, they don't lay down. So this helps a little bit, but honestly, they still unravel back up. So I'm gonna try to lay them down as good as possible. I like to do like two, Three swoops on each side. So I'm gonna start right here. Oh, my makeup. Okay, this is not agreeing with my makeup today. Eww. So yeah, that is my routine, y'all. It's super fast, way better than when I have like long hair, but I'm not all the way done. I do have to wait for this to air dry and then I'm gonna come back and then I'm gonna pick it just a little bit so that there's not so much separation. I mean, it's really not that much separation. But I'm just gonna pick it just a little. I had to come back real quick because I just noticed like, that's the thing with my baby hairs. I have to make them go inward because if I just do them like this, it look like the baby hair is separate from the fro. So I just went in and did like this with my comb so that it can, they can go inward and not be separate from the fro, you know? that looks better and then like this I think I need to twirl this part because the sponge doesn't always define everything absolutely perfectly so you can go in and twirl um different little curls that didn't curl but for the most part it did a, a good job so I'm gonna leave it alone and let it air dry I'll be back again Okay, y'all, we are back. So my hair is about 90% dry, 95% dry, but I have to wake up my kids soon and I want to finish this video. So we're about to do the final still. Get my handy dandy pick. We're just about to get rid of like just a couple of the spaces. What I like about the um, Curly Magic is it don't make me have too many spaces when I sponge. When I did it with my Eco Styler, the spaces were really wide. So I like that and it gives me like really nice curls. Let me get y'all up close of the curls.
And even though it's pretty much dry, like it is not crunchy, it's not hard, it's soft. It has soft curls. So let's just do a little wiggle. I'm just do a little wiggle. I'm not going to go all the way through, just doing a little wiggle. Just to get rid of the spaces. Make sure not to go all the way through because then it's, it's going to be pointless. All the work you just did, all you're going to do is be combing through your curls. So um, that's pretty much it. I'm pretty happy with that. And then my final step is my sheen spray, my old sheen spray. Just a little bit, y'all. The other day, I put so much. Because I like to shine, but I put so much. It was all on my car seat. All right, we're just going to do a little... All right, that's enough trophy. That's enough. Get the access. Get the access. All right. Ooh, it smells so good too. Okay, y'all. So that is my super quick TWA curl defining routine. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know what other kind of videos y'all want to see me do. I mean, it's not too much I could do, but I could do a wash day routine. I can do a hair and makeup. Get ready with me if you guys like my makeup. We can do a hair and makeup. I definitely will be playing with color very soon so y'all stay tuned for that and i'm even thinking about don't kill me but i'm even thinking about perming my hair y'all put a couple inspo pictures of what i want i just think it's so cute and if i don't like it then it'll grow out within a couple months anyway so uh yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know if you guys are liking the natural hair content or just the hair content in general if you do please give this video a big thumbs up uh yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video as always i love you guys and i'll see you guys next time bye